existence here? Is it just a place or was it actually a fort? Did you see the sign that said Fort Defiance? Am I with you or are we hallucinating together? <laughs> okay. I thought so. Is there a fort? There was. But it's not here anymore. So it's just a placard. Okay, God, thank you. Because I kept looking. Where's the fort? Where's the fort? A stronghold is a position of defense from which offense can be made. Right? You're keeping something out and it gives you the opportunity to take pot shots when you need to. I was born with strongholds in my thinking. Then some more strongholds were presented to me by the thinking of the people that raised me. I had my own, they have their own. And then we're living in a society that embraces certain strongholds and inflicts them on others. Not to mention just my own humanity. Strongholds are revealed by God to us in the way in which we respond to our circumstances. Strongholds now are consistent of what we think and believe about things. That's the building block of a stronghold right there. And so God, in his grace and mercy, has to reveal to us how unbiblical our way of thinking is. And he doesn't do it to shame us, but he does it to equip us to cast down imaginations. We imaged it. That's what an imagination is. I thought it, therefore it is. Casting down imaginations and every high thing that exalts itself. So this means thoughts, feelings, preconceived notions. They've all got to go for one reason. In Ephesians, the fifth chapter, it says, Paul said, this is a mystery. I speak of... <coughs> Christ and the church. And this is what he said. It's in verse 31. My husband spoke to you about Genesis the beginning. For this reason, a man shall leave his father and his mother and shall be joined to his wife and the two shall become one flesh. Now the Bible said they'll become one flesh. I think that suggests physical intimacy. But I also think it suggests that the characteristic of their union creates a cooperation that we call marriage. It's their first child. Your marriage is what you birth before you have a baby. 